This is the Relation Shop. What's we up? have something to talk about today. Yeah, we do. Always. So I'm Toya, Eric, and Jason. Yeah, we, know. we are in here. We yeah, y'all know. Y'all know. We're we going to get into know. this. We know. Where are we getting but into? But before we get into it, oh, if you Sign need up. community, mm. please check out. Not if. Yeah. If you mm. don't have. There you go. Because everybody needs. And you're right. If you do not have community and you need people to just be there, hold you accountable, support you through anything that you're going through in your marriage, check out Alter Marriage. And we got you. You know what's cool? Just what? on, on that real quick. So, you know, I did these marriage retreats. Yes, uh, in Mexico. Recently. Yeah, so that was cool uh, for a select number of couples. But, mm-hmm. you know, we had some couples there that are part of the Alter Marriage membership yes. community, too. And so it was cool. One night we started getting into talking about, and somebody was talking about they didn't really had stuff. And then one of the ladies who, you know, was like, oh my gosh, I gotta tell you, I didn't want community and I was against it. And Eric was like, just try it, just try it. (laughs) And and she's like, can I tell you that I wouldn't be here today if it wasn't for that. So it was like the perfect testimony. I was like, that's what I'm talking about. And I was like, that's that's normal, right? You've had so many, especially on the women's side. Yeah. So many of the women who are like, I don't want to share my stuff with nobody. Yes. Else. And then they're like, okay, but I'll just go listen. And then <laughs> every one of the ones that says, I'm going to listen, uh-huh. always messages me and it's like, yep. I talk the whole time. Yep. And I'm like, I know you would. Yeah. Yep. You hear somebody else and you're like, oh, I'm not the only one with issues. This is cool. Exactly. It's good. So nice. we have a good time. Yeah. yeah. It's and it's good. crazy it's because great. the new women do come in and say, I'm not used to this. I'm not comfortable talking yeah. to people. I don't want to say anything. I just want to sit back. And then they hear one person talk. <laughs> And then they're ready. Uh, it's they're like, ready. Blah, blah, blah. And you're like, hey, yeah. Come so, on yeah. In. Thank you for sharing. So, yeah. we, Listen, we love we, it. <laughs> we we need community. Yes. Yeah. Absolutely. Yes. Yeah. Because I promise, so whatever you are going through, it is not brand new. Mm-hmm. We, we've mm-hmm. been through it. So and we know. you need someone to walk with you. Yeah. So might as well be somebody else that is safe because yeah. they get it. And they've been exactly. through it. Exactly. Yep. Exactly. All yeah. right, but so we're we'll, not talking about that today. No, not we? today, not today. Yeah. But maybe we should talk about it one day yeah, to really go deeper can, into we, it. We can do it again. You know me. Yeah. Anytime you say community, I'm all in. This there you go. Mm-hmm. But specifically with alter marriage, we got to talk Absolutely. about that. Okay. Today we're talking about how to what is it? How to vacation? vacation. As a, I was gonna say travel, about, but no, I want to say vacation. Vacation. Yeah. How do you vacation as a couple? Because it looks different for everybody. I mean, that's this the guy is, should right? know. And this isn't trivial. Absolutely, I got my hot dog. Summer. Summer. Yeah. You've been we're gone like a year and a half. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like. <laughs> <laughs> and that was mostly all work, so it's yeah. fantastic. Yeah. Work, yeah, but work. If you got it, that's what work. What were we doing? Right. He was working. Working. You guys were doing anything? I was working. <laughs> on my tan yeah uh, yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. No, no so i think it th- here's why this is important because some people be like oh they're talking about vacation i'm gonna tune out no listen vacation is important for relationships yeah. and yeah. not necessarily just like go big vacation mm-hmm. no nope. i think vacation during the week like taking a break from the work of marriage is what we're yeah. talking about because yes. it's exhausting yeah. yeah so you need many vacations like during the week hey it's tuesday night I know we got issues. Yeah, we're just gonna binge our favorite Netflix show. Ooh, that's, sounds that's, like my kind of night. That's a vacation yep. from the work of marriage. Yes. But then we also talk about taking vacations to just get away, yeah. right? And yeah. reconnect right. and yeah. re-energize. Yeah. And so, is that with the kids? Is it not with the yeah. kids? Yep. What do you do to alleviate stress? I know. And then there's a negative side. I know some people who can only get along when on vacation uh, yeah. and they vacation yeah. all the time because, because of home life. Yep. They have not taken the time to enjoy home life. Stay so it's like, as long as we world. stay busy, yep. yeah. as long as we stay out to yep. eat and on vacation, yeah. we get along We're great. Good. We'll be poor, but... Yeah. Well, some people, some people have enough resources. <laughs> yeah. They're not going to be poor. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's just like... We're choosing to go do that all the time yeah. in lieu of actually working on stuff. Right. Yeah. Hell yeah. That's using vacation in a bad way. Yeah. Yeah. So we're talk all things vacation. Look yeah. at that. As a all couple. Things How do you manage it? We should have done this in Cancun. What are we doing here? Well, we can. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Work that sign out. Sign up. I got some work new that. retreats coming up. Okay. So you can sign up for one and come along. Yeah. I'll work on I'll that. I'll give you a you know the small, discount. <laughs> small discount. Um, sort of. But oh, I don't. Okay. That's yeah. Okay. End we'll of April. End it. of April. End of July is the next two. Okay. In Mexico. Yeah. Huh? We're, maybe. We're, oh, you're not sure yeah. yet. Okay. We'll so give you more some, details when we get everything details, finalized. Right. But right now, tickets other places are stupid. Oh yeah. Like I was trying to do one the DR. 
Um, yeah. The tickets um, are ridiculous. Yeah, they're yeah, like they're like nine hundred on the low end. Yeah, yeah. Well, I don't need to add, and I can go to Mexico for yeah, five hundred. Nah. It's probably not worth the extra eight hundred bucks yeah. a couple. So no. we I may agree. stay around in Mexico area. Yeah, well, that'll be fun. Yeah, good enough. And I still have some pesos from last time, so I might as well go back. Well use I gotta them. use them. Uh, Can't use them in, well. anywhere else. <laughs> might as well. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So I have a story real quick before we get into it. So, um, and this year has been, this year has actually been good. So my goal is to be able to work our way to be able to take a lot of trips. I feel like when we were first married, it was all about combining finances. And now we can, and I know y'all might think this is funny, but it's like, we're like, oh, we can get the highest cell phone package. We can get all the cable channels. You know, like, we don't know, have to that's, look at it. That's yeah. part of marriage. Yeah. You go from like, we're barely making it yeah, to, hey, to, now we can now buy it's two, out. Yeah. So yeah. now we can do what we want, well, right? You start having multiple kids and you're barely making yeah. it. Yeah. You're back down. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So, yeah. so we had our fun like that when we were first married. Then we had Prince, mm-hmm. and I actually stayed home. Whew. Mm-hmm. So then that was a whole nother <laughs> sacrifice, because now right. we went from two good incomes to one income, and me staying home, serving a lot at the church, mm-hmm. which was awesome. Mm-hmm. But, you know, that was a lot, right? Yep. To now where we are is, you know what? I want to travel. Like, how do we squeeze in traveling Absolutely. with an eight-year-old? But yeah. like, you know, just schedule it, right? Mm-hmm. And so, and like you just mentioned, there are trips where Prince goes with us and some right. where he doesn't. And, and I'm fine. Most it's, where he doesn't. Yeah. So I'm, I'm good. He, yeah. He's fine. But let me go back to a time that we took a cruise. Mm. It was a family reunion cruise that I planned oh, wait, for wait, my wait, family. Wait, wait, wait. Did you guys have matching shirts? Yeah, you did, did didn't you? Do you have to really <laughs> ask that question? Shirts, of course they were there. We've had this conversation. Of course they did. This is this. what we have yeah. to. That, that is tradition. Yes. Everybody has to have the shirt. Okay. You design a new shirt. Mm-hmm. Anyway, Absolutely. we plan. I Don't plan. Don't you do that, Jason? Uh, stop yeah. it! Stop it! <laughs> Stop it! Stop it! So we plan. I plan this uh, cruise for the with the family. What the shirt say? That's what I was wondering. Yeah. It says like the last names and yeah, the year yeah. and like the you know, Watkins family reunion. Yeah. There you go. Did, were you were go. they specialized? Like, where did you do the ones? Because I've seen these a lot. The ones where it's like <laughs> we bring the each couple's got something. Like we bring the chaos. No, we oh, bring no. The hype. no. It's one so they, shirt. Everybody's got like their own little <laughs> stuff nope. they bring. No, no okay. it's so very, just one shirt. One shirt. Yeah. It'll just say the year. Mm-hmm. It'll have the last name. Yeah, like Simmons That's to the it. reunion, two thousand twenty. There you go. It's like that. Okay. That's good. Basic. Keep it no, simple. Yeah. Keep your matching so, shirt simple. Yeah. Now, this cruise was at the time that I think I was a stay-at-home mom, right? So we're like, okay, this is a cruise. That's a family reunion. But mm-hmm. we also want a vacation. Okay. So I'm like, but we have a full itinerary. Ooh, this this was mm-hmm. not good. This is where I wish that I knew the steps that we're going to talk about today. Hmm. Because my priority was, of course, my family, right? Because it yeah. was a family reunion. People were coming in from everywhere to get on this boat. And have our reunion. And you plan this? I planned it. Yes, it's all so on it you. was it was all yep. on me. With an itinerary. Yeah. With an itinerary. But of course, at the different ports, that was the time that I could relax. Mm-hmm. You know? Yeah. So yeah. that was cool. But oh my gosh. I just wish that I would have said, like, really let me have my family moment and then let me have my marriage moment. Mm-hmm. But I didn't really think about it, you know, because there were times that a mom would say, hey, can we go do this? Can we go do that? And I'm like, wait, wait, I have to make sure everybody's OK, you know, yeah, or I'm just man. like, wait, hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm, I'm getting irritated right now. Can you please just stop? You know, because I'm just thinking about serving yeah. everyone else and not thinking of him, you know. Mm. So that's where that's one time that I know we took a vacation and it was just horrible okay beautiful vacation beautiful cruise we went with royal by the way and uh, it was it was nice <laughs> but i just that was not a good wife moment at all yeah you can't but go you to vacation to work lows, so i don't think <laughs> that was what <sighs> not on vacation not on cruises but i mean just hey. generally you well generally you know, I, i'm a no? human i'm no. a human eric you're mm. you're better now though I am better now. Yeah. Still so. not sensitive. We determined that on I a previous show. I have gotten show. more sensitive. Oh, I yeah. Yes. I actually think, what can I do for him? What is he thinking right now? Let me put myself in his oh, mind okay. frame. Let me okay. hold on. Like, Cap- step back to you. Let's that. go. How about we'll that? Talk about I'm telling you. When you talk to Ma, do you do your hand motions stuff? Do you know where I got that it? from? Where? 
Ahmad. Yeah. Oh, he's a wood he's chopper. A he's an air wood chopper too. <laughs> he's a. He's passion. He's passion. And he yeah, will walk okay. around the house, mouth to himself, huh. and do it to himself like this. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's, That's what he'll do. I like it does it. help. Hands help talk. So it's after hard if you do like years this of being to married to him, stuff. yeah. Could I, do it. I, I, I Could do, do it now. Yeah. So what do you have it. for tips on <gasps> okay. vacationing? So we want to give some things to think through vacationing as a couple. Let's that's, do that's it. That's what we want to give. Yeah, we're, okay. we're getting into it. I'm sorry. Well, did you, you have? Did you have a? No, no I, I, Jason no, never I, has anything. I, I, I just feel like I'm just Probably. enjoying this conversation going on between counselor and counselee yeah. over here. All, all the well, time, every, just, week. Yeah. every week, yeah. every, like, every, every week. I don't have yeah. to even yeah. pay yeah. for yeah. counseling. Uh, I mean, I'm getting it right here. Yes. Who's your therapist? Hot Dad Summer. Hot Dad Summer. He's my therapist. Who else? At your service. Oh my goodness. All right. So things to know before planning a trip as a couple. So and we'll decide if we agree with hers or not. Okay usually how this goes when toya whenever toya is excited and she has a list how many of these you got that means just 11 just a, that, you can go through yeah. them quickly you just say well, yes or no a lot that means yeah but sometimes we anyway you you do your list and jason and i will verify um all right the truthfulness of your yes list, basically. and full transparency this is not my list I got this you from halfhalftravel.com. Half <laughs> we already know you Google you, everything. There you, you go, halfhalftravel.com. <laughs> there you, you know go. What, you know what should probably happen at the start of the show, because you, you always feel like you got to make that disclaimer partway through. Like, <laughs> I got this off familylife.com or half, half. You should Your disclaimer on the front <laughs> of the thing should be all ideas presented from Toya are not her own. Not. Uh, no, I'll can, let you know when it's mine. It can be Googled on yeah, the internet. It doesn't necessarily <laughs> reflect the... Uh, Opinions yeah. and views yeah. of the relationship. But this was good. So no, here we go. Not necessarily. So. I like All disclaimer. Right. So number one, be transparent with your partner about what you want out of your trip. Easy. So have some clear expectations at the yeah. beginning. It's fair. Right? You agree with that? I yeah. would agree with that. I but mean, it sounds funny when you say be transparent. Like like I secretly have some extra stuff on theory <laughs> yeah. and I'm not telling you. But you know how I can see this being an issue. If you have someone in a marriage point that, where, you point you know, <laughs> if you, you know have it, about with issues, <laughs> yeah, 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 Jason. <laughs> if you have someone in a marriage that is always serving the other person and they never really want to speak up, like let's say you have someone that that's all into the history, right? Like they want to go to museums, they want to see ancient artifacts, oh, and, then you, the me, don't person, don't and then you have the other person, and then you have the other person like Eric, where it's that. like. There you go. Mm, Eric yeah. wants to relax, right? You want to just Heck relax. Yeah. I'm not trying you want to do, do all that. All the, and you're going to want to do activities. Yeah, so it's it. like, just be honest and say, hey, you know, I would really like to experience some of the culture, some of the things here. We don't have to overdo it, but can sure. we just squeeze a little bit mm-hmm. in? And some, then we'll have our people, days on the beach too. Some people love up every morning, meet you at breakfast at eight. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm not yeah, like that either. Yeah, vacation. Will. Right. Nah. You're looking no, at no. the back of my eyelids still. <laughs> yeah. I'm on vacation. Yeah. So, exactly. Yeah. No, I agree. I agree. My wife and I both like to sit by the pool or lay on the beach. See? Yeah. So that's, nothing. That works out. I like to read. She likes to do whatever she's doing. See? But yeah. Mm-hmm. And yeah, then you have your chill. own separate times too. Mm-hmm. So, okay, number two, be right. flexible in order to accommodate both your needs. Uh, that kind of goes into yeah, but some people aren't flexible, so that's hard for them to do. But yeah, but that goes back to the first one. Exactly. You, if you right. talked about expectations ahead of time, you can avoid some fights on vacation. Yeah. I agree. All right, I like number three. Be oh. ready to make last minute changes. Yeah, that mm. one sucks. Yeah. What? <laughs> I, I just said that because you liked it. I uh, like it. I think. Be ready. Yeah, you got it. Well, that, well isn't you, that the same as number two? I feel like all hers are the same. Like, like number one <sighs> is be ready for variety. Well, okay. Number two is be flexible. Okay. Number okay. three is be ready for last minute see, you know, Okay, so I see thing. where you're going. I'm going to help you, you. out. Okay. I'm going to help you out with this. Because uh, vacations, yeah. depending on, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah what? you just you well, just saying to yourself you over still there. still talking about <laughs> to, to, to go on vacation, things happen. Bus is yeah. late, it's probably late. Yeah. And so how the spouse reacts can Oof. kill a vacation right. or make it. And so that's why you better be ready. That's exactly. what you expect. expect. You got to be ready you for broke that. that down so and good. If, if you got a spouse that doesn't manage that well, mm. I would probably... Not going vacation for simple vacations. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> where little to nothing can go wrong. Yeah, yeah. you might just want to drive there because yeah. no plane could be canceled or yep. late, and you know, yeah, break down your car. But whatever. Yeah. All, All right. right. Give us the next one that sounds like the first three. Demonstrate uh, that you put in an effort to prepare. Yeah, that's okay. 
That one's just all right. Okay. Yeah, we'll I mean, yeah. yeah. I'm 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 kind of iffy with that one too. Yeah. It's fine. Just yeah. like all right. Off a bit at <laughs> Number five, make time for relaxing. That's yours. You should. Unless, all right. Unless some people both. Sometimes you got two people who love activity, and then yeah. you don't need to relax. But yeah, yeah, I'm there. For a little relax because yeah what about the mentality of work hard play harder so some people are like i'm on vacation mm-hmm. you know i want to do everything well, i want to experience everything i mean if i'm yeah. if i'm going to the smithsonian mm-hmm. that's relaxing to me it's pretty yeah. cool not to him yeah he's yeah. not out of bed till noon exactly. gonna do? <laughs> <laughs> that'd be awesome i'm gonna try that try that Oh, there you go. All right. Number six, surprise your partner with something unexpected. Do you ever mm. surprise your wives with something unexpected on yeah. vacation? Yeah, we just can't mention that here on this show. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing? Surprise, like baby. Yeah. <laughs> uh, surprise, no. baby. <laughs> nah. Uh, no. Out, out, no. I mean, outside of what you're talking about, other categories. No, because yeah. uh, like... I okay, mean, I was just curious. My wife doesn't specifically. I mean, you're talking. Oh my some, gosh, you planned an excursion? I didn't think she'd right. be like, no. So just specifically <laughs> for vacation, you're talking just like we're there. <laughs> and, hey, I plan this for the day. Yeah. No, I haven't done that. Yet. Or or just something. I mean, anything. It be a, it can be a gift or an, an experience. <laughs> I've done the gift or things. that's a good idea. A little gift, gift or things. something. Again, mm-hmm. you got to know your spouse. So, right. but a gift, something like that. I think that wouldn't put anybody <laughs> over the edge. I think like a. An unmentioned surprise excursion they may not be comfortable with, that's probably uh, that's, not going to go yeah, with yeah, So, yeah. Well, yeah. gifts is good. Yeah. yeah. All right. Number seven, allow for making compromises with your partner. So, this kind of one with the Yeah, other that kind of goes with yep. the first four. Uh, number eight, factor in both of your budgets. Because some people like to splurge because it is vacation. And mm-hmm. some people are like, uh, we still need to go home <laughs> yeah. and pay bills when we get home. <laughs> that's probably a big so, one. So, chill out. That is, you know what, Jill. Jill said that on our last trip because uh, we, we we were at an all inclusive place, right? Yeah, for, right. For the retreat, and I don't think we've done all inclusive since literally probably since the honeymoon. Most of the places oh, wow. we've gone, we, wow. we haven't done it a whole lot. Uh-huh. <laughs> so we were at, we were eating with somebody, and my wife's like, you know what. I, I, I like vacationing with Eric a lot better when it's all inclusive because I feel like every time we eat, he gets bitter that it's so Because, yes, yeah, yeah. like, the food, at, especially at resorts, is stupid. You go, yeah. like, eat and it's not that good and it's like 120 bucks. Yeah, exactly. Like, what yeah. the yeah. What world is this? Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. yeah, she was like, so I'm the one who's like, I don't know if we need to spend, yeah, yeah, we need no. to spend that, that kind makes of stuff. Sense. So she was like, you're much more enjoyable on all inclusive because I'm well, like, I mean, order a couple more. Yeah. Let's try, help yourself. Try one of everything. Another you know, <laughs> <laughs> drinks you know, on me. You know, yeah, yeah, let's take another round here at the table. So yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So yeah. that's true. Well, well there's, a, there's true. a good way to kill it. There's yeah. budget. Yeah. 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 You kill the budget. Mm, yeah. It's not Ooh. very fun. That's good. That was finally a good one. So good we've one. had five that are basically one. So we've had about three in your list of so okay. far. Keep going. Where you at? Number nine, discuss oh, on oh, how much goodness. you'll sh- share on social media. Now that's good. That's good because well, that's easy. I share zero. <laughs> you share zero. <laughs> I love Toy now. She's defending her own things that's before good. we get a chance. <laughs> She's like, number nine is woo, that's a good one. <laughs> woo. Yeah, before we can get in there. Because it's funny. I you know, I see people as soon as the food comes out, they're like, Whoa, 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 whoa. Snaps I gotta get a picture. Yeah. Gotta get a picture. Uh, yeah, yeah. You know, no, or on. you gotta get this, get me with the water hitting my, you know, let me post yeah. here, let me do that. And it's, so it's that's like a girl thing. I like, guess. like, hey, you, yeah. come on, I don't need to see you. So at right. what point do you say this is just our moment no phone but then how you appease your spouse by saying you know what all right tonight you can take pictures we'll do this we'll do that mm-hmm. so you gotta you know do you have yeah. that kind of balance that's some compromise again there on More differences compromise. So. yeah that one's decent almost done number 10 exchange Finally. emergency contacts with each other's family so this i feel like if you're married so maybe this one's not really for married people um, this is more for just basic couples, but if you're married, you should already have your in-laws information and all of that, just in case of an emergency. The protective measure. I guess that yeah. one's practical. Boring, but practical. Yeah, yeah that's practical. So, and number like 11. Here's the good news. This is it. Always yeah, 11, have fun. Boom. Done. <laughs> <laughs> she, she has to hype her own list. Yeah, right, so whatever right, right. website that was that you got that on. <laughs> Their list of 11 was really about a list of four to five. <laughs> and, and they stretched it and, out. And a couple of them are so basic that yeah. it's like, hey, yeah, have yeah. fun. 
There you go. I'm surprised. Hey, Pack wasn't on there, but yeah, you got a <laughs> yeah. Pack too. So <laughs> well, you know, I think that's good. They're pretty good. <laughs> yeah. Oh, kind of. I mean, kind of. Well, bad. here's what I got. I got my own list. Of Here course, we go. you do. Got my own list. Yeah. But these are stories. So I start. You know, there are so many horror stories out oh, there. Yeah. I tried. I, I did my own research to see. Like some of the worst stories. Mm -hmm. So we're going to read you some of these stories. Okay. Now, I also went out and took a poll. Okay. Took a poll. And so at the end of it, we're going to see where you think these rank. And like, oh, man, that's the worst. That's okay. the ultimate. So as, these you are vacation tell this, stories. as you tell the vacation story, we have to, do we have a just keep in numerical mind. scale? Yeah, or just, no? nah, just keep in mind. And so at the, at the end, end of it, you'll go, rank. oh, that one's the worst. Okay. Oh, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. So okay. Okay. you just get the, it's a story okay. time moment for right. you guys. You got to get the kickback. All right. Okay. So this one is about a cruise. All right. I actually remember when this happened. You'll probably remember when this happened. All right, so bad vacation. Your cruise ship turns into a floating prison. In February 2013, a <laughs> carnival cruise ship turned into a scene out of the road when an engine room caught on fire, left everyone stranded in the middle of ocean fighting for food and basic human rights. Once the electricity and running water was gone, the cruise ship guests soon felt like prisoners. Without running water, toilets, and showers, there wasn't an option. Guests were given biohazard bags to relieve themselves. Yes. You remember that? I, I do. I, I actually happened. thought you were going to say, I remember one when, I think it was like pandemic itch when this started. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah. That's when they quarantined one, they couldn't get yeah. Yeah. That's yeah, what yeah, I thought yeah. you were yeah. going to. Yeah. All right. Well, this one, there's actually a movie about that I've seen. You probably remember the movie. You could get delayed at the airport for 18 years. All right. Guy by the last name of Narazi. He um, he was kicked out of his country for his political views in Iran, so he decided to go to the UK. And unfortunately for him, on the way to the UK, someone stole his paperwork confirming his status. Stolen Paris, so he was left stranded in the Charles de Gaulle, yeah. whatever French. airport, French, yeah. yeah. From 1988 to 2006. Seriously? Stranded. 18 you, you years. Remember, 18 years. They wouldn't let him leave the couldn't. airport. Didn't have the paperwork. Had to prove the paperwork. You know, there was, there's a movie about it. Unbelievable. Seen the movie? You know I've the movie? No. Movie, huh? It's called The Terminal. Tom Hanks. Really? Yeah. Oh, well, I've I have seen movie. the movie. Yeah, yeah. Now you got to go see it. It's a true story. That's so 18 crazy. 18 years, yes. 18 years. Okay. Third, it could rain spiders in February of 2013. Another February 13. That's a bad year, apparently. <laughs> A couple was vacationing in Sao Paulo, Brazil. They noticed a light mist when they realized the mist was actually raining spiders. The spiders create giant, light, invisible-looking webs that span great distances overhead. And when the breeze comes around, the delightful arachnids get carried away, flying so beautifully and delicately through the sky. Hmm. Yeah. No. No? That was not good? All right. You getting oh, all these? Okay. Yeah. A few more. You getting your rank in order? Mm -hmm. All right. You could get cheated on at your honeymoon. After seven years together, Chris and Louise Blair got married and honeymooned in Ibiza, wherever that is. Um, Ibiza? I guess. I-B-I-Z-A? Uh, that's it. That's Ibiza? Ibiza. I'm uh, sure, you know, never, the, the song about Ibiza. I haven't. Party in Ibiza, island off the coast Ibiza? of Spain. Okay, good. I must have been somewhere else uh, pretty, <laughs> at the time. Pretty recent. No. Huh, Okay. <laughs> Okay. All right. But For not, everybody else who lives in the real world, you're probably familiar Ibiza. with that song. Oh, yeah. oh, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Took a, took a pill in like, Ibiza. Chris Stapleton, uh, somebody. Uh, uh, some contemporary person yeah, okay. took a pill in Ibiza. We can okay. probably find that I for later. All right. Anyway, all right. all right. But not long after they arrived, uh, Chris and Blair met a woman named Charlotte. Louise woke up in an empty bed. Her husband's excuse was that he went for an early swim. And he ran into Charlotte. But when he woke up the next day, Louise got suspicious and wasn't buying it. She stormed to the room and found them both there. And then her husband said, I think I want a divorce. On the honeymoon. honeymoon. Yep. Yeah. Yep. I'm right. guessing, I mean, I go out on a limb, but... I'm guessing there was lots of issues in their dating. I'm, I'm, this probably didn't come out of the blue. Probably didn't she, come out of the blue. This was one of those... This guy has proven his character over time. She was just hoping if we got married that he would not be the same. So Yeah, there you go. But anyway, that's a different show probably. How about your hotel water being contaminated by a dead body? I do remember oh. when this happened too. Oh. Yep. Mm. Elise Lamb, she was traveling Canadian. She stopped in San Francisco at the Cecil Hotel. You ever heard that story? Mm -mm. It's crazy. Go check that story out. In mm. downtown L.A. So she went missing and uh, they found her a few days later in the water tank of the hotel room. So unfortunately, the lag time for guests between the time they found her and she was missing, guests were bathing and drinking the water. So, That's kind of 
kind of gross. It was pretty gross. It was pretty gross. Pretty gross. All yeah. right. All right. You get stranded in the middle of the ocean. Tom and Eileen, they were on vacation, went down to scuba diving, came up. There's a movie about this. Boat wasn't there, yeah. right? They just know how many days they were at sea because stuff floated up with with what he had written on it. So mm. you can be lost at sea. And this one's an interesting. The last one, The Vanishing Hotel Room. A young woman and her mother visit Paris. They each get their own room. Not long after arriving, the mother collapses. The young woman calls a the doctor. They examine the mother and determine that she needs to make a trip across town, the daughter does, to pick up some medicine for her mother. They gave her reasons why they couldn't do it, so she runs errands, takes her hours. It seems like everything went wrong. She finally got back, and uh, the front desk clerk had no idea what she was talking about. Her mother wasn't there. And so the daughter talks to everyone at the hotel. They were like, we don't know who you're talking about. It's not there. You know, you're, we haven't heard of this person. So she goes and that makes them open up the room. And the room is has somebody else's luggage in it. No sign of Weird. mom anywhere. Psycho, the movie. So it's the, yeah, it's the disappearing room. So All there right. you go. There's your horror so stories. Here's, here's what we're going to do. We're each going to take one shot at the worst in see your who, poll. See who okay? picked the worst so in the poll. the worst in your poll. See who picked the worst. Um... Yep. Yeah, I'm gonna go cruise ship. I'm gonna go cruise ship is my worst nightmare. What's your February worst? February 2013. I'm gonna go with the dead body. Yeah, actually, the number one was the vanishing hotel. The coming really? back and your mother gone. That was the. I number mean, that one. is creepy. Yep. Yeah. yeah, the the cruise ship was too. So you weren't okay. far mm. off of that one. Yeah, so basically, I won. Yeah, oh. dead body thank was down you. at the bottom. Thank people, you, thank you, thank you for joining care. us wow. today. Uh, make sure you like and subscribe, and we will be back and next vacation. week. Vacation. Yeah. Vacation. 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 Are we taking a vacation? Vacation. We should. Vacation. Mexico. Boom. Oh. Mm. All right.